Hello everyone, welcome back to Crusader Kings 2, where consumption is still just breaking out like crazy in certain parts of our country. We are at war with Bohemia, trying to take territory from them, and we are coming to lift the siege of Krakow and murder and stuff like that. You know, just, just the normal. And by murder, I mean we're going to absolutely slaughter them. Because we outnumber them two to one, and it's gonna be a good little victory for us. Great job here. Alright, I want y'all to go down to Messin. And in the meantime, um, what is this? You want to marry my grandson. Who are you? My granddaughter. Granddaughter wants to marry my grandson. That is a terrible idea. First cousins marrying one another? I mean, like, literally? That's what you come up with? Give me a stinking break. Come on, HRE. You could really throw me a big bone here. I'm hoping we can catch these guys. Yeah, let's catch them. And then we'll move over to Messin. Because nothing says kick them while they're down when you have such a big army. No, they don't. I probably need to be cognizant of. No. Keep struggling to just find the artifact. Okay. That works. Let's let's get this show on the road, please. Let's race him. News from China. Do we care about that? Oh, that's lovely. How close are you? Please siege this thing down for the love of everything that is holy and pure. Yeesh. All right, so we need we're gonna have to some stuff to clean up, and we're probably gonna have territory to hand out. Fall of the Teutonic State. Who'd they fall to? Ooh, they did fall. Well, that's not good. I have a feeling that what we're going to be doing is taking this army going to Krakow. Yeah. Yep. Where do we face a defeat? Oh, I guess up here. Oh, we lose the trait paranoid. Fantastic. All right, we've really got to get back to Krakow before they siege that thing down. All right, that's what we wanted to see. Hopefully, we can get there before it falls. 
I think we will. Maybe. Maybe, Lord willing. Maybe not. Sh ah, that's not good. Yeah, we're not going to get there. I don't know. We may get there. Yeah, we are. Good. Scared them out of that. Okay. You fully siege that down? You have. Good work. And we got a bunch of crap to siege over there. Dear Lord, have mercy. Getting close, though. We can butcher these guys. Because that's what we're doing. Who are you? Why are you upset? Seems to be a common theme around here. Alright, so now that we've cleared that threat. <sighs> That's what I feel like. Let's go pile on because we have four freaking things. Okay, set back. Yeah, good for him. Of course, he's going to receive a setback. Literally donated nothing to that cause. Which I'll continue to donate nothing to that cause. All right, so there is that. We've got three more things to siege down. And then Poland gets bigger. Let's try to bribe him. Hopefully. Well, he didn't take the money. Boy, is that unfortunate. So they're going to go back for Krakow, which is hilarious. They can waste their time on that all day long. This war will hopefully be long over by the time they get around to that. All right, so this thing's fallen rather quickly. And then after that, we'll just have to take another bishopric and bye. Gonzo. Dunzo. Elfinito. Oh, we can finally take tech. What tech can we take? Shall we take legalism? Friends, I think we shall. And we'll worry about all that later. Oh, God. Camp fever now? Man. That's not rough. In the least bit. Okay. Come on. Just take it already. For the love of everything that is holy and pure, just take the city. All right, so this is our yeah, granddaughter. You know what? That, that reminds me. Did our son ever get remarried? Interesting. Well, we've got 100% war score, but I want to siege this last thing down so we don't have to worry about stuff like not having the territory that we want. And Poland's going to get bigger. Bohemia is going to get weaker. And that's what we're talking about. All right, 100% war deal. We're going to offer peace. Yep. And we now have a bunch of stuff that we control. And we have effectively sequestered, if that's the right word, Italy's back. Um, uh, I guess that's okay. We'll take a look at the world because we've got a bunch of administrative stuff to do. So Poland now shares a border with the Holy Roman Empire. And yeah, we need to start fabricating on this stuff right here because that makes me feel a little better about containing bohemia okay so first things first 
that's going away. Next thing's next. Let's go ahead and tell these guys to get back to Krakow. How are you doing? 32, 33% done. Okay, what do we hold? That's probably a good question. We gained this, which I don't necessarily think is, I mean, it's not bad land. Um, hmm. I could get rid of that, that's for sure. Let's just take a look at our holdings. So, that's a good one. That's decent. Get rid of that one. I think if we're going to keep any of them, it would be keeping definitely that one. Definitely mess, yeah. We can give away this castle. All right, so let's uh, take a look at our family. I give you land that may cause a problem all right that that will definitely cause a problem um wait our son has popped out just an enormous amount of children this is wonderful because you're gonna get Lubelin Why can't I grant you a landed title? That's probably why. Well, Fooey. Alright, well, let's just find some people in our court that are loyal to us. Ah, oh, golly, this is always tedious. That is in my primary duchy. But it is the worst province in that duchy. Hmm. All right, here's my son. I can't grant you a landed title, can I? All right, well, here we go. Boo -doo -boo -boo -doo -boo. Court. Who is unlanded? This is a chancellor. I love the land you. All right, we're gonna keep messing, so we have to get rid of that one, and I believe. That no, that one. These two. Okay. I'm gonna give it back to you. I'll grant you a landed title of. Lower Silesia, okay. That fixes that. Now, I want to arrange a marriage. No, don't want to do that. 
Oh, he's got the cancer. Oh boy. Oh boy. She's married. All right, we'll let him figure that out. That at least clears that up. So he formed a defensive pack. Yeah, I'm fairly positive. That does not shock me one bit. All right, well, Poland's bigger. Bohemia is definitively weaker. And yeah, Italy's come back full circle. Okay, well. There's now a defensive pack against me that we're gonna have to wait to let that settle out. Let's send everybody home. And ta-da. All right, can we do any upgrades? Yep, we can. We can do some upgrades. And, okay, Camp Fever. We know Camp Fever. Can we do anything such as hold a grand tournament? I don't want to do that. I don't think we have any sins. Uh, we could donate money to the Teutonic Order. I'll do that. And okay, yeah. Ow, that hurt. All right, we're we're almost at time, so I'm gonna kind of. And do a little bit of an overview, check a few things. Let's take a look at the laws of the land, the realm. We get a max, which could hurt us. Uh, I think we're going to leave that as is. Let's check our titles. We need a new master of the hunt, which we'll just do that. New cup bearer, cup bearer. We'll do that. You can have that. Court tutor, gonna be you. And I'm happy with that. Okay, so let's take a look at the world as is. So Poland just picked up a chunk of territory. Bohemia's got a revolt on their hands. Burgundy has ceded territory to, I'm thinking that's Aquitaine. Yeah, they took over some stuff. Leon is still a bit of a hot mess. That guy's there. Jerusalem still has Galatia and that. More territory. Oh. Ooh. Canem Borneo. Borneo. That. What is. Whoa. You, my friend, look unbelievable. That's awesome. Are they Catholic? No. They're definitely not Catholic. For real though. All right, so then you have that. You have the Tulanids, the Hashemanids, uh, Pratharia, just as beastly. Perm still exists. Britannia has has just done the dirty work. And then there's us and the Byzantines who are in revolt again. Well, that was fun. Um, I do before I say this because I'll forget. We need to tell our Chancellor to do something what do we want to go on now yeah over here we want to clean these these up right here we want to get this stuff boom all right so we're gonna start we're gonna fabricate on all this stuff and that'll be the next chunk of territory we take and yeah Windish Empire I have not forgotten 
All right, so we could do that. And we're at 60%. I think we gotta have 80. So another 20% and yeah, we'll be cooking with grease. Ladies and gentlemen, as always, I hope you enjoyed it. I know that I did. The War with Bohemia came quicker than I expected. Um, there is a bunch of crazy stuff that's going on in this world. And I can't wait to see how it finishes out. I hope it's going to create a rather unique and interesting EU4 game. I think we're set up to do that. Um, at least I hope we are. So I will see you all in the next episode. You all be good. Have a wonderful night, noon, morning, whatever other time it could be. And I'll see you next time.